Irish the T from Riverdale, Georgia. Please welcome Mariah Stackhouse. What's good? It's your boy Roger Steele, and today we are at the John Ship and Cognizant Cup at Upper Montclair Country Club in New Jersey, an event that helps bring diversity to the LPGA Tour. Today, we have nine of the best black women golfers on earth competing for a chance to win entry into the Cognizant Founders Cup, one of the highest persons on tour. Now, if you don't know who John Shippen is or why this relationship with Cognizant is so important, let me show you. John Shippen is an American hero that no one knows. He actually was the first American-born golf professional who happened to be a black man. He was the best golfer at the club. He fixed clubs. He gave J.P. Morgan lessons in golf. He was the head pro at Anorometa in Pennsylvania. People need to know that John Shippen was the first American golf professional. He played in the second U.S. Open in 1896, and it's always this uh, kind of running joke that if he would have won, we would be having a whole different conversation of actually who John Shippen was and is. He was a disruptor before our, what we're attempting to do in terms of being disruptive within the space. Our goal is to continue that legacy of, of telling that story about who he was and is. And so we have a series of three events. We have two women's events, two exemptions, and then we have a men's event that has an exemption for a PJ Tour event as well. You know, as an African-American woman playing golf, you don't see a lot of people that look like us playing often, and just everything that he's done, you can see how it's led into every African-American that's come after him and has really opened the doors for us. Just to have the opportunity to compete for an LPJ exemption is a really big bonus for girls like me, especially who aren't yet on the LPJ level. And it's also good to just test ourselves in these conditions and see how our game matches up. So right here on the team, we got Georgia Obo. She's the first Nigerian woman to play in the LPGA Tour event. Perfect. Great drive. Great drive. So with everything that you all are out to accomplish with the John Shipping, how meaningful is this relationship with Cognizant? So it's very meaningful. Um, we love the fact that Cognizant is using their assets in order to be disruptive. It's great for them to put their money where their mouth is, because a lot of companies say they're going to do, and they don't. So not only did they come to the table with an exemption, but they also put their money where their mouth is to make sure these women had a great opportunity, uh, that we were able to eliminate the barriers by covering their travel, covering their hotel, their food, because that's what this is about. It's about making sure that within this conversation, within these opportunities, they're eliminating barriers, but also can see what is possible as well for themselves. The LPGA is working to increase diversity amongst women and persons of color, which is similar to the practices that Cognizant is trying to do when hiring and increase the number of women and persons of color across the organization. It's really about increasing the opportunities and to really level the playing field. All right, so right here, we got Madison Barnett. She just turned professionally not too long ago, but she had an amazing amateur career. Good shot. Going into the round, I was just like, I just want to have fun. I don't care what happens. I just want to have fun. Enjoy the course. Be grateful for having the chance to play this course. All right, so it was a little tight, but Paige Crawford opened up about a four-shot lead. If she makes this putt, she's a 2023 John Shippen Cognizant Cup champion. Check this out. Playing with the John Shippen tournament, seeing all the black girls, it's amazing to be in that environment. Congratulations. 
growing up, I was always the only one. Even in college, there's maybe another one. But to be in that environment is something that is so special and I will have for a lifetime. Hopefully there will be more of us on tour. That's what I want. I want us to break those barriers. And I am seeing more and more black girls playing golf, which is amazing. You know, having me and Mariah and other girls out there, young girls can see us and be like, that's who I want to be. And I really want that to happen. So that's a wrap from the John Shipping Cognizant Cup. Hey, shout out to the John Shipping for continuing to grow a great legacy and give black golfers more opportunities. And shout out to Cognizant for continuing to level the playing field.